Okay, everyone, we are back for another Dragon Ball Z Dokkan battle video. Today we're talking about JP side of the game, so we got some uh, pretty good information and pretty cool information when they uh, Dragon Ball did their one year anniversary live announcement for uh, Dragon Ball uh, the Breakers content. They're having their first year anniversary, and pretty much all the uh, all the games are getting some stuff from it. Like uh, Dokkan Battle got five stones, Legends got a hundred uh, Chrono Crystals or um, whatever you call them. Uh, Dragon Ball Zverse 2, 800 Time Patroller Medals, I believe they're called, and then if you actually play the Breakers for the Broly coming to the to the game, they gave you uh, some tickets, it looks like. So, I have personally not tried the Breakers yet. I've heard some good stuff, but it's kind of more of a, a fun passing time game with friends, it sounds like. But it does look pretty cool, and anytime we get new Dragon Ball stuff, I'm all down for it, right? But today, we're talking about JP side of Dokkan Battle, our favorite game, right? Now, just uh, remember, Global and JP are getting synced up eventually over time. We're not sure exactly when, but hopefully, fingers crossed, it's within like the next year, which I think is very reasonable for the two games to get synced up. But they announced that during the Worldwide Download Celebration. If somehow you have not heard the games are getting synced up, spoiler alert, they're getting synced up. <laughs> About time, huh? But... Over on JP, we got two new characters announced during this whole Dragon Ball The Breaker celebration sometime after that. But um, basically, we are getting a side banner unit of Vegeta and Nappa here. And then also a new Dokkan Fest featuring Gohan and Piccolo. Anytime, anytime we get Gohan characters or units in Dragon Ball content, games, whatever, new cards, I love it! <laughs> I, my favorite, by far my favorite character in the Dragon Ball series is Gohan by far. Um, I think just Gohan has went through a lot of stuff as a kid. Him and Piccolo are a tag team duo I love seeing. I watched Gohan grow up as a kid, you know, fighting Cell, stepping up to the plate. He has his berserk moments. Then he gave him Beast Gohan in the new movie. I could go on for ages how much I love Gohan. But we're going to be taking a look at what Gohan does today. Uh, Gohan and Piccolo here. But it seems like they are fairly, fairly good. Um, we're actually going to start off the video with watching their animations, which I have for you all. Right here. So let's uh, kick off with some animations here. So this is the Vegeta and Trunks, or I mean, Vegeta and Nappa animation. Honestly, dude, these animations are pretty good. Especially with Vegeta shot right here. I love them. I love them. Vegeta's probably my second favorite character. Now, Gohan and Piccolo. These animations look phenomenal. It honestly looks better than the anime. It looks very good. Touched up detail. Piccolo looks great. Solid 10 out of 10 for me for that animation. Now, this is where people are going nuts, right? This is insane. Watch this. So they get the KO revival, right? Right here. This is so good, dude. Listen to this OST, man. Look how good this looks, dude! It looks amazing! It really does look phenomenal, doesn't it? These shots right here. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Gohan means business. I love when he gets angry. Watch out. Okay, not gonna lie, there's some memes already about uh, Gohan running. Okay, that's what that guy it does look very funny, right? I love it. Man. Oh my goodness, guys. Please tell me you are hyped for that, man. Please tell me you are hyped for that. Oh my gosh, alright. Uh, let me uh, cut over to some uh, translations here. We'll be right back. Okay, so we're back. Looks like courtesy of our boy uh, Proton and Minit Minato. Please go toss some follow here on uh, the X or Twitter. I still call it Twitter. I don't know what you guys do. But we're going to look at the details for STR Piccolo and Gohan Kid slash Gohan Kid, right? Um, after the uh, KO revival skill, he turns into just Gohan Piccolo dies, right? Um, but this is when they're still paired together. Just, you know, start a turn. Here we are. So, leader skill. 
Bond Master Disciple or Saiyan Saga, key plus three, one seventy percent stats, plus an additional thirty percent to characters who also belong to the Earthbred Fighters category. Solid leader skill. Actually, that's really, really good for a lot of newer players and current and existing players. That's that's a solid W in my book, so that's good. There are 12 key super attack effect. Greatly raises attack and defense for one turn and causes immense damage. Okay. Passive still. Here we go. We're going to get a story. Key plus 2 in attack and defense plus 150%. Raises attack up to 150 based on HP. Okay. Plus an additional attack and defense plus 100% when performing a super attack when HP is 70% or above when receiving an attack or the first or second attacker in a turn. Reduces damage received by 40%. They get damage reduction, which is phenomenal. Bond and Master and Disciple or Saiyan Saga category. Allies key plus 2 and attack and defense 30%. Wow. So they get damage reduction and they support. Okay. Very nice boost so far. Let's keep going. As the third attacker in a turn, key plus 1 and attack and defense plus 30 to all superclass allies for 3 turns. Okay. When they're in slot 3. When HP is 70% or below at the start of turn, or from the 7th turn from the start of battle, the characters or an ally in the same turn as KO and exchanges with Gohan Kid and recovers 70% HP once only. Links. Gaze Respect, Demonic Ways, Cold Judgment, Brainiacs, Sea Fighters, and Fighter Fierce Battle. Not the best on Links, but there, there's some good ones in there, don't get me wrong. It's demonic Ways you're never going to get, I feel like. Categories, Bond and Master Disciples, Saiyan Saga, Earthbred Fighters, Joint Forces, Powerful Comeback, Spawn Rage, and... Okay, so some pretty good ca categories. Now, when you get that transformation, here's the big boy himself, Gohan, here. So, after you get the Revival skill, right, you get knocked out, Piccolo dies, you get Gohan out. Uh, super Attack, 12 key, massively raises attack and defense for one turn, causes immense damage, okay. New Passive Skill, key plus 2 in attack and defense, 150. Attack and defense plus 100% when forming a super attack, and plus an additional attack plus 100% when HP is 58% or above. Now remember, you get the 77 or 70% HP regen to on this active or revival skill. Um, for one turn, key plus 12, and attack and defense plus 300%, and performs critical hits when performing a super attack. Guaranteed crits, very nice. His stats are going to be phenomenal, I can already tell. From the third turn from the first appearance onward, attacks effective against all types. Wow. Superclass allies key plus two. Great chance to form a critical hit when there's a pure Saiyans category enemy. When there's an ally who names include Goku on the team, evades enemies attack for one turn. And from the third turn from first appearance onward, high chance to evade enemies attack. He gets built in dodge too with a guaranteed dodge with Goku on the team? Are you kidding me? This is why people are going nuts over him, man. This is why people are going nuts over this guy. Okay. I get you. I get you. See? Dokkan is trying so hard to get you to spend your stones here. But for both Global and JP. Global's getting in Super Saiyan 4 LR Goku. JP's getting this new Gohan in a Piccolo combo unit. They're wanting us to spend stones before Heroes and some very hype stuff coming up. Man, that's cool. So they are very, very good, man. They are very, very good. Wow. The, uh, the official Dragon Ball Twitter did very well with this uh, information release. Okay. Good job. Good job, Akatsuki and Bandai. Very nice. Actually, I want to see if we can find uh, translations for this, too. Let me, uh, give me one second here. Okay, well, I could not find any translations for the Vegeta and Nappa units, unfortunately. Uh, there's somewhere around there, but I just couldn't find any. So we're going to probably do a whole separate video for that, but... We got some very cool stuff coming for both Global and GP Tokum Battle. Hopefully you guys are excited, man. I'm uh, I'm getting excited for LR Super Saiyan 4 Goku coming to Global. I main Global. I do play JP a little bit, but not too much. Uh, just logging in and doing missions here and there. Summons when I can. But when the games get synced up, I will no longer probably play, have to play JP at all. Right? The games are going to be on the same page, and that's what I'm looking forward to. But, man... Do whatever you want with your stones. Just keep in mind that we do have a very hype hero celebration coming with a lot of uh, very good units. Like we just seen Broly, uh, Vegeta, and Dark King Fu get released or announced the other day too. So we had some very good stuff coming for the hero celebration. That heroes team and crossover team is one step away from being top tier. I'm telling you guys. But all right, that's going to do it for uh, me, everyone. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. It helps my channel out greatly. We are trying to get 1,000 subs, and you guys have been killing it with the support. So I thank you so much for watching my video. But all right, guys. hope you have a wonderful, wonderful day. Until next time. Bye, guys.